Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. I'm going to be doing this wig install for Eunice. I have a 20 inch 13 by 4 HD body wave frontal wig and yeah, let's just go ahead and get into it. This wig was super easy to plug and everything. You guys know, um, you guys can check out my other videos to see exactly how I do like the foundation of my installs as far as like the cap and what I use and whatnot. But if you guys would like for me to update the tutorial and basically go over it everything that i do all over again i'm willing to do that as well but i usually use erica j glue i'm not using that today i'm using some bolt hole active got the job done it's not what i'm used to but honestly i may continue using this product um i've been wearing this install for a couple of days now and i haven't had any issues at all it still feels super tight no signs of lifting whatnot um so yeah i mean it's been it's been going really good so far as you can see from the title this is an hd wig like i say it's very easy to bleach very easy to plug and one thing that i do want to get back into can we get back into the full frontals like i love me a good full frontal you know i make it work we're doing my side part but i'm definitely a side part girl and i just be wanting the full frontal so that i can get the full effect you know what i mean instead of like i don't know feel like i have a cut corners or whatnot so like i said um pretty much in this video um doing my normal routine i really haven't changed much up but i am starting I am starting to pluck a little bit more. I hope that's correct grammar. I am. Anyway, I am starting to pluck more. And um, I decided to do some wands. I believe this is my first time doing some wands on my channel. So I was super excited. I actually used the Marcel iron um, to do the wands. Marcel curling iron. So that was really, really fun and beautiful. But as you guys can see, I'm just kind of going through my natural, normal steps. And we getting into this. I'm still using the fluffy um, baby hair method. I don't know if I ever did a video of that on my channel, but I think I may do one. Um, and I always use hairspray to mold my edges down. Do it last as long as when I used to use the um, Gorilla Snot? No, but I definitely feel like it's still worth it. I ended up um, trying to help it get it done before and my son came into the room. Well, his dad brought him in the room. He can't walk. He's only a few months old. And you girl, it's a mother. That's all I've been gone, but it's been great. It's been going really, really good. So I've been really happy with that. But I didn't want to like kind of, I wanted to switch things up today and kind of like tuck the hair all the way behind my ear. Instead of like kind of like molding it over a little bit. If, if you guys know what I'm talking about. I just decided to do it over my ear. And yeah, now we're about to get into these wands. Eunice sent over this big, beautiful paddle brush, which I love. It's literally the best. This robe is from Eunice. It sent me over a lot of gifts and I really, really enjoy that. So you guys should also go follow me on TikTok. Follow me at Hair by Cradesia and then at Cradesia for mom content, lifestyle content, or whatnot. Your girl is starting to post more on there, but I'm definitely going to stay on YouTube too because why not? Okay, I'm good. One thing that I definitely could have did is hold the, um, the curls on the barrel a lot longer they would have got more defined but like i said my baby came into the room and i was on mom mom duty as well as trying to you know curl my hair so i had to do what i could do but next time i would definitely recommend holding it a lot longer
normally wands take a good bit of time but this honestly took me like maybe i would say 15 minutes and i would honestly say that that was only because i was kind of distracted a little bit while watching my son I kept the wands going the entire, like, I kept the wands going the same way the entire direction. That doesn't even make sense. I kept the wands going the same way throughout my whole entire head, pretty much is what I'm trying to say. If you guys are also interested in a lifestyle type of channel from me, I also do have another channel. It's called Life with Cradesia. I just started it. Um, so I'll put all like the, my new social media handles in the description and on the screen as well. So you guys can go follow me if you're interested in content like that. I'm super excited to just, you know, just produce life content really comb these curls out a little bit let them uniform a little bit more like I said they weren't perfect but they definitely got the job done And that pretty much does it for this video. As y'all can see, they turned out really, really beautiful. I hope you guys like this tutorial. If you guys want me to go in depth about anything, just let me know down in the comment section below and like this video to show you too that, hey, you know, this is actually a pretty good video and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.